so I'm I just finished cleaning out the inside of the ice maker before you start to, to use the ice maker you need to clean the interior the basket the lid all of it just clean it with a mild soapy water mixture um, and then you drain it out you fill this up and rinse it and the water will come right out of your drain spout so I'm going to um, I've already pulled the plug because I was draining it but I'm going to pour water through again so you can see And when you're rinsing, remember to rinse your secondary reservoir. So I pour water in there and it will drain out at the bottom too. So when you've done your cleaning cycle, you want to rinse both your main reservoir and your secondary reservoir. So when you've finished cleaning the machine and you've dried it out, then you can fill your water reservoir to the fill line, which is indicated right here in this little ridge. And there's a little line there and you don't want to go over that line. Now, this is in preparation for your first use. So we've manually cleaned the machine. Now we're going to set the self-cleaning function. So it's running the cleaning cycle and it will run for 20 minutes on its own and then it will automatically exit this cycle and when it's done then we can drain the water out and uh, turn the machine on so that it can start making ice it did cut itself off and it went back to zero and so now i'm going to pull the drain plug out drain it fill it up again with water and set it to start making ice So I just press the on switch or the ice clean switch and it's starting to make ice. That is the symbol that you will see. And I used three of these bottles. They're 16.9 fluid ounces. So one about a pint. So I used three of those. Um, it, it didn't get quite up to the but it wasn't enough to for the machine not to work so this should take about 10 minutes for it to start making ice actually started pushing out little ice cubes about five minutes into the uh, 10 minute cycle so we haven't really hit the okay so now they're coming out um, it's pushing more out so We'll see how long it, it takes to fill up this basket. I don't know what's going on. It seems to have stopped making ice cubes and it's just running. I don't have any error messages. The ice symbol is still flashing. And you can see that's all the ice it's made in about yeah, there I think it just pushed out another little but that's all the ice it's made in about 10 minutes so um, I don't know I'm not really sure the juice is going to be worth the squeeze on this one you'd have to start making your ice if you're going to do a smoothie you'd have to start 5 o'clock in the morning I don't know. I'll give it another try and see. This machine is is loud as you can hear and it appears that this unit is making ice very slowly so I'm going to call the manufacturer. There's a number on the back to call. So after my last uh, video my husband suggested that we run another cleaning cycle on the machine and then start the ice making process over again and that helped um, you can see the machine has been running for about an hour and so the basket is about 
two thirds full. Um, so it is it is working, and it it made the ice a lot faster this time than it did the first time. And so I think because we put we also put cold water in the reservoir. And the last time I used um, room temperature water. So we put in cold water from the refrigerator and that seemed to get the ice making process going. Okay, so that's it. I really do like the small size ice cubes because it's close to the crushed ice that I like as opposed to big cubes of ice. I still think it might be um, a little noisy, uh, but if you're not going to be running it all the time, I guess it really doesn't matter. And you can set the timer on delay and you can set it to cut off after a certain amount of time. So I'm sure you'll be able to find that happy medium that works for you. I think the price might be a, a little bit much for this particular machine, but I don't think it's a bad, I don't think it's a bad machine for a bar in your basement and you're going to be making I, um, ice and serving, you know, drinks or for making smoothies. Um, I think it'll work fine.